Welcome back to another episode of Defense and Aviation Update in 10 Slide Info. With plans to keep the Mirage 2000 fleet operational until 2035, the Indian Air Force is planning to enhance its capabilities, and one of the main plans is to integrate these jets with Astra Mark I air-to-air -air missiles. Astra Mark I has been integrated with Indian Air Force's Suhoi Su-30 MKI and will be integrated with Dassault Mirage 2000, HAL Tejas, and Mikoyan MiG-29 in the future. The currently integrated MICA IR and MICA RF Beyond Visual Range air-to-air -air missiles has a range of 80 kilometers, which is very much less compared to the other advanced air-to-air -air missiles available with other countries. Integrating the Mirage 2000 with Astra Mark I missile, which boasts a range of 110 kilometers, would significantly improve the jet's long-range air combat potential. The Indian Air Force has requested Dassault Aviation to integrate indigenous weapons like Astra Mark I on Rafale fighter jets, but they would not be providing any kits for integrating these Astra missiles on Mirage 2000. Also, Dassault Aviation has ruled out integrating the Meteor beyond visual range air-to-air -air missiles on the Mirage 2000, so the Indian Air Force should work with the DRDO team in carefully modifying the Mirage 2000 frame to integrate Astra Mark I. Additionally, DRDO's ongoing development and trial of the Astra Mark II, which has a range of 160 kilometers, will further enhance the long-range air combat potential of the Indian Air Force's Mirage 2000 jets. Even if the Mica NG comes into picture, it might be limited to the Rafale fighter jets, leaving the Mirage 2000 fleet with a potential capability gap. So, the Indian Air Force has to expedite the work on integrating the Mirage 2000 jets with Astra Mark I missiles at the earliest, so that these fighter jets are combat ready until they retire. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tenslide Info for more such updates and analysis on defense and aviation. Thank you.